Okay, got the gun all made. It's got double controls on it. We have control for this feed line here. And this control flows a total amount of fluid flowing through the line. It's got a nice big handle. You can wear gloves when you're using this if you wish. Two individual control valves control what line you're drawing off of. These are industrial braided lines, extremely strong and very, very rugged. These are able to withstand any chemicals you throw at them pretty much. The same is true with the gun. It's an Italian made degreasing gun, very effective. Common feed manifold, anodized aluminum. Anyway, let me show how it works. If you open up one of the control valves, it controls the singular fluid to come out. Turn on the control valve. Then you have control for that jet stream of stuff. The other way to do it is, of course, open the other valve up. Now shut that one off. The other way to control another additional fluid is with this knob here. You give it a good shot. So whichever way you want to go works out pretty good simply by controlling which way you turn the valves. The thing's all rigged up into a backpack piece. You've got double control valves on the back. The ball valves allow to add fluid, cleaning fluid, in each individual chamber. The other chamber cleans water, which is filled by hose. And it's all pressurized by hose as well. So you have individual control. So, should be a pretty good little unit. You've got so much control on here, it's probably a little bit too much, but hey, the quality is there. You've got industrial design, and I'm sure you'll be very happy with it. Okay, Arthur, I'm going to add red, water, soluble food color to one of the chambers. I'm adding blue to the other one. Should be enough. Hope so. Okay, you just normally pour in your cleaning solution, shut the valves, and now you pressurize it by hose. You can interchange these lines any way you like. I currently have them hooked up water on the front and two other tanks in the back. You can re rearrange them any way you like. Water on the front. And then we select one of the chambers from the back. Let it purge through. You can see it's quite red. A little gross if you're doing a horror movie. Turn off that chamber. Turn on the other chamber. It'll purge out. And now we get blue. So now you have individual control of both chambers. And again, you go with back of the water. But that's the idea.